Well, hello there, chums, and welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm going to be doing some cooking in my kitchen. I'm going to be baking some bread. I'm hopefully going to make myself a lemon drizzle bread. Yes, I'll show you. I'm only using two ingredients. So let's give this a go. Hello, chums, I'm using the Tesco breed of self-raising flour. And I'm going to be using lemon curd by Yeo Valley. And it's organic, so it's going to be super healthy. At least I think this is going to work. I've got a mixing bowl. I'm going to be putting three cups of safe raising flour into the bowl, along with the whole of that into the bowl, mixing it up and seeing what happens. So we have this, it's a measuring cup. That is a cup, apparently. I don't know how many milliliters or whatever that is. It says on the actual handle, but I can't read it because I ain't got my glasses. But there we go, one cup. It just says one cup, actually. Yeah, I can read that. Okay, cool. We're gonna use the one cup, three cups of this, and then one cup of that, basically. There we are, let's get it going. Hello, the Ivy, you all right? I'm gonna help you then. You're gonna open up the uh, the uh, self-raising flour for me so I don't make a mess. Look, she's making it so I can't make a mess, people. I better still make a mess, because I'm a messy puppy. Hey, girls, what I am. There we go, oh look. I'm getting that open, it's like wallpaper post. Might as well get a little bit of extra in there. There we go. Now we're gonna be doing the cup. Oh, she's already going in with the cup. There we are. Okay, that's a that's a very heaped cup, isn't it? Mm. Is that what you do, is it? Um, Hopefully, there's going to be enough there for you to do your bread. <laughs> I'm making vanilla ones. Yeah, Ivy's going to be doing a vanilla bread on her channel. Vanilla? Yeah, vanilla bread for yours. Mm. Thank you. Two. Mm -hmm. oh. One more. Chicka pow! Lovely jubbly. Okay, well there we are. So then it's just one cup of this apparently, isn't it? Now, if there's any leftover, I might mix it and see if it's too stodgy. We'll see how we go. Mm. Does it smell <laughs> nice? Does it smell nice? Yeah. <laughs> oh, that does smell quite nice. All right, cool. So the idea is yogurt has got yeast in it. So it should, hopefully... Oh, so oh. it's one cup. It's one cup exactly. And then oh, dang pour it. one and one fourth here. Oh, okay, more. cool. All right, well, we'll put a lot. Yeah. Get me, uh, Just put the rest spatula. in. Just stick the rest in. Spatula. Cool. Spatula. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Using the spatula. Make sure we get it all out of the cup. And then we might as well put in the rest of that, mightn't we? Yeah, because it's, it's supposed to be one and one fourth cup. Look what is inside. Yeah, yeah, that's it. One and more, one fourth. That's, that's probably going to be just enough. Just enough. <laughs> And I know that I said I was only going to use two ingredients, but I am tempted to put in some calamansi honey in there. Do you, what do you think? Should I put in a little bit? Just to no. just to make it taste a little bit more zesty? It's up to you. Don't mess up. It's not, I don't yeah. know if it's going to... Go on then. Try it. Why not? Yeah, I can do. So I'm just going to add in a little bit of this. Now, it's not required. You can just do the two ingredients. I'm just adding that to give it a little bit more zest. How much? Yeah, just, just a little bit. Just a... Uh, it's from Philippines. It is from the Philippines, that one, yeah. yeah. Um, but it's got all good stuff in it. It's got like um, vitamin C oh, plus and stuff. zinc. Oh. That'll do. That's enough. Yeah, that's, that, that's more than enough. Cool. Lovely. Right, well, I get mixing that and get it turned into a dough. Oh, dear. Mm, dough, dough. Okay, well, it's, it's starting to thicken up. Look at that. It's starting to get there. But it's going to take a little bit more than that to get it into a proper dough. It's very powdery right now. That's going to take a lot of mixing. I'm probably going to have to come back in five minutes when I'm <laughs> done mixing. Yeah, mix, mix. So, I think it's better to actually mix it by hand. And uh, look how sticky that is. That's okay, how it's it should like be. It's like Play-Doh right now. And you want it to be like the consistency of Play-Doh. If you remember Play-Doh from a kid, that plasticine. But yeah, just try and get all of the powder into a goo. That's pretty much it. Now make sure it's no powder anymore, make sure it's... Yeah, it's still a bit powdery at the bottom there. Yeah. Not quite in there enough. It's take a while, Stephen. No. Half yep. an hour at least. Yeah, do like that, mix okay. it. Uh... Okay, mix, mix. <sighs> okay, I've been doing this for a good, like, what, five minutes now. And you can see all the powder has gone. It's now just a big doughy mess. And look at my hands, they're very doughy mess right i just need to find myself some sort of 
baking tin or something to put it in. Maybe put in a little bit of grease proof paper so it doesn't stick to that tin. And then we're, we're pretty much good to go. Is that it? I don't oven. think so, look. Yes. No, it's not. Yeah, this is self-raising flour, so it's gonna be big. So hopefully you're gonna have a nice tin for it to go in. All right, well, there we go. That's all, that's all mixed mixed. That's all done. Okay, chums, well, my hands are now clean. I mean, yeah, I did wash them, but there we go. It's already mixed. Ivy's got some bacon trays. Which one? Are. I think this is better. That one's got a sticker in the bottom. I'll go for the black one, please. Sure? Yes, please. Lovely, jubbly. Now I'm just going to transpose this into this. Just adding in some grease-proof paper in there so it doesn't stick. Well, and I'll be putting the that? filler into there. Right, I'll just transpose it over. I'm going to need both hands to do it, so there you go. Wait. Okay, so we're going to go for all at once, or try to anyway. Come on, you know you want to come out of this bowl. There you go. Splodge! <laughs> oh yeah? Wait, wait. Okay. Make sure it's not going to come out from this thing. Okay, so I'm just going to sort of spread it around in here, I guess. Oh my god, this is going to turn into a right loaf, isn't it? Okay. Squish it in. Squish! Squish! Squish it this way. <laughs> okay, this is going to be interesting. Squish it back that way. Ugh, get in there, you. Oh dear. Yeah, let's put the paper a little bit. Push it around a bit, get it as flat as you can in there, and I think that'll do the trick. Then into the oven for 40 minutes. How many degrees? Um, <laughs> okay, so if I, I'm going to preheat the oven to 200 degrees, wait for a little while, and we'll be putting that in. Okay, well, I've put it inside of the oven, I'm going to leave it in there for 40 minutes, and we'll be back soon, people. Okay, people, well, it's smelling like it's cooked. It's looking like it's baked. Interesting. You might have to just put a knife in it and see if it's cooked all the way through. But that's looking pretty darn nice. I did put it on a shelf lower than this. Have you hired it, Ivy? A little bit. But it's cooked, uh, I think. No, it's still doughy in the middle, isn't it? Oh, no. Yeah. Okay. So put it back in, put it lower. And I'll turn the temperature down a tad and hopefully it'll cook in the middle. Yeah, I did put it on a lower shelf. Ivy's put it up, so it's burnt the top. Nice one, Ivy! <laughs> okay, chums, I think it's about ready. I'm just getting the oven glove, getting it out, making sure the middle's cooked through. Then we might have some of this with some ice cream, maybe. Well, chums, it seems to be cooked all the way through, so I'm just sort of cutting it down the middle here. You can see it's nice and soft and still a little bit doughy. Very nice. Just get that cut. Huh? Have this top half each, yeah? Oh, it's really hot. There we go. Right there. Let me see inside. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Yummy. You can make a bread. I can. I can make bread. Mm -hmm. Okay. That the way it is. Yeah. I'm gonna try a little bit. Here we go. Super. This is actually quite good for my first attempt. I think done okay. Mm, very nice. Cool. Here we go. I'm going to put some ice cream with the bread. Have a little bit of ice cream and bread. There you go. There's a lot of ice cream. Okay, okay put well, more, I'll, put I'll, more. I'll, I'll have this Put more of mine. Yeah. There you go. Ice cream and bread. Yummy. 